Hello everyone! I'm here to share some news not to miss. If you haven't done so, make sure to head on your Creative Cloud app to download the June 2020 release of your favorite apps. But let me show you how you can do that. So I'm going to jump right into my screen. As you can see, I already opened my Creative Cloud app. You can do so perhaps from your bar here is the lovely cloud creative cloud logo there or from your main creative cloud application for desktop when you've done so and clicked on it you will be able to see that our favorite apps had a full new look the icon icon looks different but most importantly uh, the features are different and we are going to explore them during this week but first of all let me show you how to update so as you can see I already updated the main one that I use so Photoshop Illustrator but I haven't up updated Lightroom yet so let me zoom into it all you have to do is to click on update the big blue button and it will start to download straight into your desktop. If by any chance you still don't see the app changing um, there into your deck, for example, like here, um, of course, this is the old icon, but it's still in the process of updating here. All you have to do is perhaps restart your computer and you'll see that beautiful new um, little icon that will be updated as well into your screen. In order to learn more, of course, you can stay tuned in on the amazing Adobe Live on behance.net slash live because this week will be dedicated to the new amazing feature of Creative Cloud 2020 June release. So what else you can do is to head to the internet and check out, you can simply Google um, Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Illustrator, Adobe InDesign, Premiere, whatever you fancy. In this case, I've got ready Illustrator and you can already see this new beautiful icon the key of minimalism we got rid of the stroke we made the text a little bit bolder absolutely fantastic and same here for photoshop and in design now if you want to jump and learn more about this fantastic app and the new feature all you have to do is click on the new feature tab here it is. So once you go and over on your feature, you'll be able to see what's new. And the very first thing you'll be able to see is the June 2020 release. Now, don't be afraid you're not alone in this journey. In fact, on this Thursday, I'll be on Adobe Live with Giovanna, which is a freelance part of my studio, Prove My Soul, and we'll be showing with you how to work and how to discover the new feature of InDesign June 2020 and as i wrote on one of my posts on instagram i do have an extra surprise for you so this is a, a very very exciting day because it also is the fifth anniversary of studio for my soul i got a little emotional there <laughs> but yeah i've been running my practice for five years and i'm looking to launch a brand new website and i'm gonna do that do that during the stream but there is a gift for each single one of you. And I'm gonna reveal on Thursday, how can you uh, receive this free gift? But I'm gonna tell you today, what is this amazing gift? So first unveil, sneaky peek to the gift. And let me just jump into the screen. Are you ready? <laughs> Here it is. I've created typeface. You probably seen on Behance before so far um, was a typeface that I created starting from a graffiti piece, then transformed in an installation and outlined it in Illustrator. But what is new is that I've created a font, a free font that all of you can use for free if you discover how to download it during our stream on Thursday. Uh, the font is called Guest of Cake. It's not available anywhere, but it will be from Thursday. And uh, just to give you a little bit more of a background and show you an example, um, let me jump into my screen. As you can see, you will learn how to download the phone on Adobe Live on Behance June 18th, this Thursday, while we learn the new techniques and the new feature on InDesign June 2020 release. And as you can see, this font was inspired by a 
piece of wall art, a graffiti that I've done a few years back. But the most important thing is that now it's available, will be available for you and for all of you following the stream. As you can see into our beautiful character style panel, we can read Gestalt K, which is the name of the font. But the most important thing is that this font um, will be available for you to write whatever you want. Um, so let me just jump into our window here and edit the text because we can just use it. Oops, I'm just gonna write by Claddy. You can write whatever you want. It's a crazy funky display font. Of course, I don't advise it to use for text. It's definitely something for adding for title um, and is for you to use. So hopefully I'll catch up with you on Thursday. Don't forget to go into your uh, Creative Cloud and update all your apps because we're gonna be working with the June 2020 release available from today for everyone. So make sure to get comfortable with the new release and feel free to go into uh, the wonderful Adobe website to discover the new feature. But most importantly, stay tuned. And if you want, you can also uh, get a little reminder here. You can set a reminder for our stream, me and Giovanna, you're gonna get two Italian this time <laughs> instead of one <laughs> during the Adobe Live. I look forward to see you June 8th. So many things happening. Again, a date not to miss. I'll see you soon, everyone. I hope you stay safe. Bye.